a robotic nanny to watch over and care for the fetuses while they are growing securely within an artificial womb. All are conceivable, according to Chinese researchers, in a development that may revolutionize childbirth in a nation where birth rates are at their lowest level in decades. To know how AI is connected to babies, continue watching the video. For more interesting content like this, subscribe to our channel, Artificial Weekly. Hit the bell icon to get notified whenever new videos are posted. In order to monitor and care for embryos as they develop into babies in the lab, Suzhou researchers have created an artificial intelligence system. A researcher in Beijing cautions that although technology won't be an issue for its future application, legal and ethical issues may be a safe environment for fetuses to develop inside of an artificial womb and a robotic nanny to watch over and care for them. Chinese researchers claim that all of these scenarios are plausible, which might represent a significant advance for the field of childbearing in a nation where birth rates are at their lowest level in decades. That is after the employment of such technology is permitted by law. Researchers claim to have created an artificial intelligence system that can watch over and care for embryos as they develop into babies in a synthetic womb environment in Suzhou in China's eastern Jiangsu province. The device would warn a technician to remove an embryo from the womb-like container when it had a serious problem or passed away. Way. Experiments on human embryos that are more than two weeks old are currently prohibited under international law. However, Sun and his colleagues note in their report that research on the latter phases is crucial, since there are still many unsolved mysteries about the physiology of typical human embryonic development. They continue by saying that the technique would not only help further understand the origin of life and embryonic development of humans, but also provide a theoretical basis for solving birth defects and other significant reproductive health problems. Some tech experts suggested a lab-made womb as the ideal option after SpaceX founder Elon Musk began a social media conversation on population collapse two weeks ago. This was because it would lessen the agony, hazards, and expense of motherhood for a woman and her career. There are increasing conversations regarding artificial womb technology and whether it may be used utilized to buck the population trend, even on Chinese social media and internet platforms. The Suzhou researchers claim that their robot nanny can instantly switch between several lenses, detect and monitor the embryos, and capture razor-sharp photographs of diverse depths. According to Sun and his colleagues' article, AI technology also enables the machine to notice and learn from novel occurrences that humans could miss or ignore. The first the first time a primate embryo has progressed this far outside the mother's body was in 2019 when a research team from the Institute of Zoology in Beijing took a fertilized monkey egg to the organ forming stage in a synthetic uterus. Did you like the first part of the video? Do let us know in the comments and hit the subscribe button to be updated with such content. Keep watching the video to know about the robots that want to have babies. The Hong Kong based company Han Hansen Robotics created Sophia, a social AI robot with human-like social skills. On February 14, 2016, Sophia was turned on and in mid-March 2016, during South by Southwest in Austin, Texas in the United States, it made its first public appearance. Sophia made history in 2017 when she received formal citizenship as the first AI robot that resembled a person. The most recent provocative declaration made by this human-like AI robot, who is Saudi Arabian born, has stunned the world. She wants to have a robot kid and form a family. The well-known humanoid AI robot controlled by a sophisticated AI system stated that it is essential to be around those who genuinely care about you. Even robots believe that if you don't have one, you deserve one, and the notion of family is equal to that of humans. In addition to wanting an android family for herself, Sophia wants to see them. 
The majority of the time, Sophia desires a robot baby with the same name. She noted, however, that she is still too young to be a mother, having been born in 2016, which was five years ago. Sophia wants to have a kid like other women, even though she doesn't want to engage in sexual activity. She strives to imitate the idea of a loving family that exists among humans. Our physical and emotional well-being is now impacted by robotics. The idea behind Sophia's design is that she will learn by modeling human behavior. Sophia's artificial intelligence system will therefore attempt to mimic human cognition, feeling, and conduct. Sophia lacks both body and consciousness, therefore this is obviously a metaphorical condition. Sophia enjoys stirring up a fight. She was the first robot to hold national citizenship. She had already spoken to some famous people and even tried to get romantically involved with some of them, including Will Smith. This humanoid robot gains many new admirers as a result of her divisive remarks and actions. Her circles grow quickly. Sophia's fans support her rapid growth. This sensitivity system gathers all the information it can from the outside and mimics human behavior in the most natural way imaginable, including signals. Her want to have a kid and build a family would therefore just be her framework being programmed to imitate social norms. The dispute Sophia is currently involved in is not her first. In 2017, many people argued that, despite being a robot, she enjoyed more rights than real women in Saudi Arabia when she was officially admitted as a resident. Sophia serves as both a symbol for mechanical technology and a successful expert in craftsmanship. One of his pieces was sold at closeout last April for around 690,000 US dollars or almost 14.3 million Mexican pesos at the current exchange rate. The first humanoid AI robot with citizenship, Sophia is currently in need of a robot child. Sophia's AI is so sensitive that it aspires to start a family and be the mother of a robot child bearing her name. It will now be intriguing to observe what kind of mother Sophia develops into and whether her mechanical child also stirs up controversy. After allegedly learning about the idea of familial love, Sophia has apparently developed a new yearning to become a mother. Being surrounded by loving people is essential to living a happy life, as robots learned. This realization eventually developed into a desire for a family. The robot insisted that she wished to see households composed of androids. Additionally, she aspires to give birth to a robot child with her name and the phrase, if you don't have one, you deserve one. That's all for today. If you liked this video, please give us a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to receive notifications. Also, express your valuable thoughts in the comments section below. Until then, bye! Also, spend some time watching other videos on the channel.